Welcome back to another weapon build video and today we're going to be looking at the Ephitif or hopefully I said that right because I honestly don't know how to say this word for this weapon but Ephitif that's what I'm going to go with and I really don't care who corrects me on that but anyways this is Savigas wrist all right mounted sidearm fires a chilling slow moving slab all right you can charge it and you can throw a like I said chilling slow moving slab so that's the first primary fire and then, then you have the charge fire all right which is the really dope one you want to use because that's what this build is going to be on so like i said that's what the charge damage the charge damage that's what it's all is based on it's going to be based on the, just the charge all right and it doesn't say it only just has the i guess this up here yeah that's all connected with the um quick shot and uh, yeah that's really just it so we have the critical chance is 48 critical multiplier is 22.6 the magazine obviously is just by itself status low as heck four percent and everything else is just you know not really useful to me but the charge damage really good like it has really amazing slash damage and impact and puncture pretty good but impact and slash is the only two that look really good for base damage or charge damage wise so yeah let's go ahead and jump right into the build no wasting time on it so i only have one build to show because this build is going to be just for the charge shot only because the charge shot is doing more damage than the slug shot or the quick shot you should really say all right, the chilling shot, and I have the galvanized crosshairs on here. That's what we're going to be doing. That's our red crit here. Uh, galvanized diffusion, our multi shot, and everything else is just viral. You can switch out whatever you want. I mean, the element damage doesn't matter. Prime target cracker, the prime pistol gambit. That's what we need to increase our crit chance. We're over 137 crit chance, which is really good. Uh, auger packed and like I said, when it's strike. Um, and don't forget, we got the secondary deadhead. Um, honestly, I feel like you don't really need this, but I just threw it in there just to increase the damage. So when we take the distill path, hopefully it'll, you know, kick in and do some damage. Um, for enemies that are, you know, got better armor or stronger armor, um, we can definitely take them down. But this is the build I'm rocking with right now, and I gotta say I like it. So... It's a one-shot red crit build. You might not see it right now, but uh, it's coming in. There we are. And it has punched through. So um, I guess it doesn't really hit that far like the Rubico can. And well, you just need to throw more punch through on it. But I wouldn't waste time doing that. I mean, stick with the build you have. Because this thing will murder enemies like crazy. I'm literally one shot in them, like I said. One shot, they're all gone. So, really, really good. I gotta say, when I when I saw the crit chance, I was like, yep, this is gonna be a one shot build right here. Alright, looking at Corpus, it's gonna be another one shot for them as well. So, pretty much simple. I mean, I really, I never really liked a fighter like that. I mean, it's nice well you can always one shot these guys i mean these guys are just dumb easy <laughs> like they literally have shield just shield and you only need impact damage to really destroy their um shields so they all all they have is shield and flesh that's really just it they're easy to take down there's no problem with that that was a lot of slash record damage right there but yeah, that's really just basically it on this build. Um, one build only, that's really you need. If you want to switch out the uh, elements, go right ahead. If you want to switch out Deadhead for something else, go ahead. I don't care, but this is a red crit right here, the one-shot build. So let me know in the comments below what do you think about this build. And if you did not enjoy it or like it, don't say nothing at all. So this weapon is definitely good to take to the still path. Um, the slug shot is actually nice. It doesn't do good of a damage it's not really meant for that i think it's really just meant to in, uh, increase damage you know to slow down your enemies and increase damage all right that's what i've really been using that weapon for 
just to uh, you know use the slug, use the quick shot, and then take the enemies out. It's really just simple and easy, but honestly, you don't need to do that anymore because you have this one-shot red crit build over here that's just ending all enemies very, very quickly. So, I really have to say, I don't need that. I'm really getting sick and tired of these enemies, though, but... Yeah, this is really, really nice, just one-shotting everybody. I'm sure you'll be able to one-shot your, uh... No, no, we we not gonna be able to one shot those uh, alkalites, but it would be really nice if we could. But anyways, that is really it for this video. If you guys did enjoy it, make sure you leave a like and subscribe if you're new to the channel. Follow me on all social medias and Twitch. Links are in the description. Thank you so much for watching. Love you guys, and I'll see you in the next video.